Okay, so today I'm very glad to say that we are replacing the temporary threaded rod which was um, which is used throughout the tower. I can show you. Um, throughout the tower as a temporary solution I use this as threaded rod waiting for the, the bars to come. Um, and they have arrived today, so let me show you. So instead of um, this one to hold the screen up, we're now looking at a, a proper um, engineered LU solution. And instead of these um, threaded rod sections, we now use these beautiful aluminium sets. Oh, the focus is bad. Okay. And then we've got, yeah, this is what they look like. Come on, it doesn't want to focus. Okay, um, and then we've got the short ones as well. So, woohoo! We're rocking and rolling. And I'm going to reassemble the tower now with the bars and I'll show you. Okay, so how cool does this look? Yikes. Okay, there I've got my first bars in. This is for the screen. And it used to look, it's a years an old one, it used to be temporarily the threaded rod, as you can see there. Um, but now it's replaced with proper alu rods. Ooh, woo, looks awesome. This will just tighten. Excellent. Yes, it looks beautiful. Okay, so we've just done all the long bars. Ruben, thank you <laughs> for doing all my bars for me. Pleasure. And now we're going to do, see, so we've got five long bars. There, oh, there's another one. Oh, no, that's not, that's uh, inside there. Here's one, here's one, and here's another one. Um, and now we're quickly going to do the two short bars there and there. And then we can mount again. Then we're ready to rock and roll. I've also just, um, for interest sake, I've taken all the, some extra um, water precaution. Because the cables are now quite easily, easy to work with, I've basically just put them each in little bags. And it makes it super easy now to stow away and, and work with them. Really cool. Okay, so the one new feature is the fact that these bolts are now properly um, made from alu, uh, which now I'm putting them on with 10 more bolts because it fits the existing holes of the KTM screen. And the way that it's mounted, what's really great now is instead of taking your complete tower off or your screen off if you want to work with it, you now have the added benefit of lifting it. How fast now? Here you go. So if you really want access to your tower for some reason and you want to do it like that, you simply lift it or you can put it down and it just swivels on the LU. It also has locker, little locker nuts at the bottom here. I don't know if you can see. So if, you've, if you're not going to work on it, you simply lock it and it's up. Very cool. Tell them to up. So it does that. And back. Okay. Great. So in summary, if you remove just this bolt that holds the, the side together, you want to work on your tower, you take the bolt off and you flip the whole nose up. It was like a truck. And there you go. You can work on everything. Um, super easy and putting it back you basically flip it you don't need to take the tower off at all basically put it back and you bolt it on shabru poof my little engineer